Hello, Mr. and Mrs. Reader. This is Kevin Richardson at North Trail RV. Been selling these Numars for 27 years now. And they are a great machine. Here's your computerized leveling over here. Just push one button and you're done. You gotta be still a little, that's all. Automatic headlights. It's a nice instrument cluster, all digital. I have it on steering effort now to show you you can adjust the steering effort on the fly. Two nice big monitors, GPS navigation and so forth. And all the easy to read buttons. Over here we have in front of the passenger seat a flush floor, all solid surface. Very nicely done. And then we have a uh, desk for the passenger place to put a little drink and both the driver and passenger have wireless charging stations and then here's one if you have it like a tablet or something you can plug right into the USB for your charging cabinets are super smooth completely finished and just a beautiful job. Soft to the touch. Here's uh, all your electronics together. Your inverter, of course. That is your Traveler satellite dish. That We're going to set that up for DirecTV for you. And there's the modem router up there. Let your cell phone provider know the EEIE number on the back. And that will turn into a modem. That TV in the front. Here's your Bose soundbar at the top, your Televator TV, your um, satellite dish receiver will go up in there too. These don't come with DVD players, they stopped doing that uh, two years ago. But all your electronics will go in here and it's all labeled nice. Everything is just hardwired, professional, and done very nicely. There's a couple of HDMIs. One for DVD, one for satellite dish, if you have them. And then we'll move over to the kitchen. I took the stove tops off and the sink covers so that you can see how gorgeous they are. Black stainless, really pretty. I like the low divider too. You're gonna have a lot less splashing from the faucet as you're moving things from one sink to the next. And the stove, you can remove, just lift up from the right and left sides, lift it straight up, pull the electrical plug out, plug it into the sidewall outside, put the stove top on top of your picnic table, and you can do all your cooking outside. Of course, that's a convection microwave here. This is about uh, almost two feet, oh, not this one, the one above the refrigerator is about two feet deep. This one's for spices. Got a nice big window. A window's an option. That's a nice window. Beautiful backsplash. And everyone wants to know where the trash can goes, right? We have that question a lot. Where do I put the trash can? There it is. And these are soft closed drawers also. Lots of room under there. And on the left side, that's where you put your sink covers and your stovetop covers. So you can store them in there. And that way they're not going to move around and they're out of the way. Your heat from your hydronic zone heating system will come out the louvers there. If you so choose, you can also blow hot air through the ceiling. Here's another drawer in here. So you can pull out all your, I don't know, whatever you want to put up there, you can pull it out to you. <laughs> Nice soft clothes, adjustable. Numar is really into convenience, so they make everything adjustable height. Or lots of things, adjustable height. And here's your big TV with your freezer, nice maker down on the left. And that's water in here. We'll put the uh, water filter in once um, you know, the day before you pick it up. 
nice and deep. And like I was talking about before, oh, that's a lock right there. The black thing right there is a lock. Slide it to the left, and now you can't open the doors. And here's a nice deep cabinet for cookie sheets and so forth. Skillets, things like that. It's at least two feet deep. Now we'll go back opposite the sofa in front of the TV, and there's a queen bed sofa, very comfortable. Notice how there's tile in front of the sofa. You have to get a Dutch star in order to remove all the carpet. Both the driver and passenger seats have power footrests, so when you spin them around, they're going to be recliners. Lots of cabinets up here. About 18 inches deep, I would say. And they're three-dimensional, you know? They're not just straight across, boring. Instead, they're 3D. They're different angles and shapes. Not super deep. And if you don't want the clock, I'll be happy to take it off your hands. Some people don't like them, but I think it's just gorgeous. Okay, so the dinette, you have two drawers. And the right side does the same thing. To put puzzles and games and things like that under there. The table is wonderful. Pull it out. On the other side, push that down and there's a leg. So the table doesn't bounce. Right now it's bouncy, but that'll provide support on the end. So I'll go ahead and show you that in a second. There we go. So there's the leg on the table. Nice and easy. And there's two leafs, two 10 inch leafs that will fill in that gap. And there's also under the bed, two fold up chairs. So you can sit six people here. Okay, here's a nice pantry. It's all lighted. That's nice. To uh, pull out the drawers, you push them in and that releases the lock. And as you can see on the sides, they're adjustable height. So you can make them taller or narrower. In this closet, uh, you can use it for the kids in the bunks. They can put their undergarments in there, some socks. You can also hang up some clothes, shoes, um, brooms, vacuum cleaner things like that or use it for like a linen closet too you're gonna sweep all your dirt right into the floor here's your central vacuum just sweep it right in and there's the one for the hose on the left and that's a courtesy light to the left of that and here's your main electrical station in here so we hit the home button now we can see all our tank levels. We can adjust the energy management system. We can um, do AC in here, turn on the fans, automatic generator start, Bluetooth pair. So once you go to the Connected Solutions app on your phone, you can control all these features on your phone. It's pretty cool. Here's the middle bath on a cantilever door. Let me turn the lights on in here. And once the door is closed behind you, it turns into a big room. So there's cabinets. This is the middle bath. Really cool sink. Almost like a clamshell. This place is to put extra TP rolls. That's how you're going to flush the toilet right there. Just push a button. And a super nice backsplash. Newmar does a fantastic job compared to other companies. Medicine cabinet. GFI breaker too for a blow dryer. Or to charge your shaver, razor, toothbrush, whatever. More space for like 
towels, washcloths, and things. Or a washcloth in here. You won't. This is no shower in here. And a nice towel hook, towel ring. Is all your connections all together for your light switches and your fan. Uh, breaker box is in here too. Here's all your breakers, electronics. Easy to read 12 volt fuses. All the lighting in here is 12 volt. And your 110 breakers. Everything is labeled. Nice and easy. We're still in the middle bath and there's lots more closets. No adjustable shelves in here. Let's see what's in this bottom drawer. Well, you can put something in there, lots of something in there. Maybe the black tank deodorizer and just I'm sure you'll find things to put in there. See how Numar uses the chains so it doesn't bang into anything? Doesn't hit the toilet. And then of course you have your TP holder. Got your ceiling fan. It's gonna take out. It's not gonna give in. It's all gonna, it's an exhaust fan. And there's your cold AC duct. It'll also blow hot air if the heat pump is on. Now we'll head outside. So now we're outside the middle bath. And you know, this is probably for the people in the bunks. Now you got a little drawer to put their shaving kit in, toothbrush, things like that, I guess. And at the top, they can hang some shirts. Fold some clothes, put them up top. Okay, so now we're heading into the bunks. This is solid wood. Solid wood little ladder for the little guys to get up at the top. Bunk. Optional TVs. Monitors. They can plug in their devices. There's a window there with a shade. Light switch. Another 110 plug with USB ports. And the whole thing, this whole top bunk can fold up. So you can use it as a closet when you're not using it as a bunk. So that'll give you six feet of more hanging closet space. Now here's the bottom one. Pretty much the same thing. They have their own window too. Down below you have three large drawers. That's got to be at least two feet again. Utilizing all the space under the bed. And there's three drawers just like this. This is the middle one. So here's an overview of the front. Got a beautiful decorative ceiling too. You don't see ugly plastic ceiling ducts. Like you do on other motorhomes in the same price range we sell as this. Without this beautiful decor in the ceiling. And the beauty of these vents is, see those uh, slats, those, that's where the cold air is coming out, that's where the hot air is going up into those, and the cold air is coming back down. And when the slide outs are in, the cold air is being blown between the two slide outs while you're driving. Where everyone else puts their ducts on the outside so that when the slides are in, Cold air is being blown on top of the slide and not in where the people are. The new mart's very smart. There's a nice uh, in, uh, accent light. It's pretty. So here's the kitchen countertop with the covers back on. There's the plastic duct that I was telling you about. There's one there in the hallway and two more in the rear bath and that's it. The bedroom, we're heading into the bedroom now. 
another decorative ceiling diffuser beautiful these lights have a high low button on them too so you can dim them look at that beautiful uh, fascia on the slide out and then you have the bed of course gorgeous bed beautiful um, bedspread and runner Underneath the bed, the uh, cabinet, you'll have more light switches. A little piece of art right here. And it's removable if you don't want it. On each side of the bed, there are USB and 110 plugs right there. You can access those through that little opening at the top. Run the wires through there so they're not sticking out. And the left side has the same thing. Now here's a place to put a lot of shoes. Well, once the chairs come out and the two leafs for the dinette table, you can put a lot of shoes in there. And that's air mattress, sleep number. It's a new and improved sleep number. Lots of storage under there. And at the foot of the bed. Six drawers. Large TV. Looks like a 40 inch. And two more shirt closets. At least 12 inches each. If not 18 inches. hanging closet and then you have your safe the sides all open there's the books with lots of manuals in it from Newmar you have six drawers just like that and if you touch them the drawers they're super smooth, they're sanded, they're not rough. You're not gonna get any splinters. So they just do a beautiful job. I can't say that enough. Tile on the slide. They've been doing it since 2016. Every year they get a little better. So this is the new and improved version. We're going into the rear bath now. Well, we have the toilet flush. Lots of other switches that are pretty self-explanatory. Place to hang up your towels. Nice window. And there's your escape door. Instead of going out a window, like everybody else has, Newmar gives you a door with a ladder built in in here. It's a telescopic ladder. It takes about maybe 30 seconds to get outside. It's wonderful. And then just zip it back up when you're done. You can only open it from the inside. There's two latches. A latch and a deadbolt. There's your Splendid washer and dryer. Everything is tested before you get it, including the washer and dryer. Look at this beauty. It's a nice sink. And you're not going to hit your head on the cabinet, <laughs> like in some motor homes we have, when you're brushing your teeth. And of course we have the nice big medicine cabinet to put your shaving cream, makeup, blow dryer, and there's even a 110 plug there. They're thinking. Nice backsplash too. Sorry about my finger getting in the way sometimes. That's where you put your toothpaste and your toothbrush in there drawers. His and hers. Maybe. <laughs> Two drawers just like this. Nice and deep. Lots of room in there. Easy access. The bottom one doesn't do anything so don't try and open it. That's where the A, a engine access is. Oh, look at the beautiful shower. It's huge. 
engine's running so we get a little vibration in here. You can sit down in there, shave your legs. All solid surface, it's beautiful. Nice inlay designs, solid surface floor, no fiberglass. Get your Aquamizer blue light on. Here's your rain shower head. Nice. And a handheld. And you use that to rinse out the shower. That's what I do with mine. A place to put your soap and shampoo in that cubby hole. We teach you all how to use all of these features. That is a giant shower. It's wonderful. And there's your linen closet with another little shirt closet. You can hang up bathrobes in there if you want or whatever you use for getting out of the shower. Adjustable shelves again, nice and deep. There's the ducts in the ceiling. Taking out hot air in two and blowing cold air down in one with another fan. Now, thick the roof is. It's the same roof that's on the King Air for 1.7 million. And you have a cathedral ceiling in here that's rounded. So if you're tall, Brian, you're going to love this with a cathedral ceiling. Adds about another four inches of height in the rear bath. It's a black mirror. That's about it for the inside. Okay, I'll show you one more thing. Hold on. I get this question a lot. You know, can you close off the bedroom from the bunks? Well, yes, you can. There's the pocket door, double pocket door. The other side of that is the bunks and the kitchen and the living room. And then you also have a pocket door for the bathroom. So the person in the bathroom can have privacy. These are solid wood, too. So here's one more quick overview of the whole coach. So I just shut the doors for the bunks, shut the pocket doors, and the bathroom door. And that makes a queen bed very comfortable mattress and in case you have lots of people you want to sleep looking directly at the TV I'm trying to go slow so I don't make you guys dizzy <laughs> wood grain dash too and you have a power window driver's window is nice and of course everything is dual pane that's an option as well and there's some more electronics down there for the driver down below and a place to put maps and things down there and of course drawers Okay, let's head outside. Okay, starting with the front, there you go. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's got 360 cameras on this one. So driving down the road, you can see all four sides of the coach, which is super nice. Got the two Nova awnings up there and the little umbrella awning, I call it. With the porch light, keyless entry. 
So you come up with your own code. You hold down the one button for three seconds, it locks everything. Get your huge 365-70 tires for your 19,000 pound front axle, which no one else has. Not in this price point. She's gorgeous. First compartment, we have the basement freezer. Oops, I locked it. Now well, the basement's unlocked. Got a super big, super nice 12 volt or 110 refrigerator freezer. You set the temperature on both sides over here on the side once you turn it on. Above the basement refrigerator freezer is a shelf, so they made some good use above it. The older models did not have the shelf, so that's a fairly new feature is the shelf. So here's the rest of the um, basement, just huge. Those diagonal supports are very important. That's what makes the Star Foundation. Very stable ride. You're going to love driving this, Brian. And possibly your wife, too, if she likes to drive. Very easy. And that's how you're going to empty your central vac right there. Outside. Get all the dust and dirt outside and leave it there. See how everything is just professionally hardwired in. And you don't see any plumbing lines in here, so you're going to reduce your freezing possibilities. So Numar runs their plumbing lines through the insulated 3-inch thick floor. There's some pegboard for screwdrivers, hammer, wrenches, whatever you want. You can put some quarts of oil up there. You know, whatever you want to bring with you. There's lots of room. And there's another camera for the 360 camera system. And that up there is a security light above the window. There's one on each side. There's a switch inside you can press to have a side illumination. Huge rear tires, too. This thing's going to drive like a dream. And this is a docking light. There's docking lights on both sides and in the back. There was another docking light towards the front. So two on each side and two in the back. There's the escape door, in case of emergencies, or you can load up whatever you want through that door and hand it to the person inside. We help people with that a lot. There's your engine batteries, of course, and your engine chassis disconnect switch. That's your particulate filter down there. Above this area is the dryer vent, and it's painted, it's not chrome, so it doesn't stand out, blends in with the rest of the motorhome through this phenomenal masterpiece paint job that Numar does at the factory. Sides of the slides are painted as well, and striped just like the sides. Got a phenomenal air dam up there with two Venturis built in. Another camera. Those Venturis are gonna keep all the dirt off the back of the motorhome. So down here, down low, we have an Air Force One um, plug. So you can easily add a braking system onto your car and it just quick disconnects right in that port. Keep in mind, this coach has not been cleaned up yet. This is the way they come from the factory. So, this will all be cleaned up by the time you get it. Easy access to your main filters. Your Oasis Hydronic Zone heating uh, antifreezes in there. Your Redhead 8.9 liter Cummins 450, 1250 torque. 350 service stations across the United States. It's awesome. Freightliner Mercedes-Benz. And now we're kind of in the shade a little bit on the driver's side. 
is your side draft radiator. Fake awning tubes at the top to make it look uniform. That back compartment there is where you're going to fill up your DEF. We're going to fill the first one up for you, of course, and it's good for about 3,000 miles. Okay, so here's your dump station with a power water hose reel, whole house filter, outside shower, and everything is very self-explanatory thanks to Numar writing in plain English what to do with each valve. <laughs> See? This device here is called a slipper hinge. See how the door is now lower than the frame? And it's shorter than the top frame. It's a Numar invention. That's so that it doesn't hit the slide out when the slide out is out. They won't hit each other. Like you do on some manufacturers when the slide out's out. When you open up the doors on the driver's side, they hit the bottom of the slide out. Not with Numars though. So now, watch this. It's gonna go uphill until it closes. 50 amp cord reel, electrical station, and that is a 50 foot electrical cord where most companies give you 30 or 35 feet. This is 50. And it's soft rubber, so it'll be able to go back in even when it's cold temperatures. This thing's amazing. 10 times better than Aqua Hot, so Oasis is the best. There's two heating elements. You don't have to use diesel fuel. You really don't. But if you do, it's super easy to work. And if there is a hiccup going back and forth from shore power to generator power, all you have to do is hit the reset button, which Aqua Hot doesn't have. And then it reboots it, kind of like rebooting a computer. And everything is just fine again. Next compartment over, just huge storage. This uh, slide out tray goes both directions. That floor, by the way, that basement floor is three inches thick, fully insulated. This is a four season coach. So it's gonna be very quiet inside when you want it to be, especially when you're next to a road or just anything loud. It's gonna be very quiet. Here's eight AGM house batteries. Those will last you five years at least. Maintenance free, you don't have to do anything. There's a pin on each side to secure it plus a latch. So that's a redundant system. That's the way Numar likes to do it. They wanna make sure you don't have any issues. And the last compartment we'll cover here is the chassis. This is the chassis area. <laughs> you don't wanna to put too much stuff in there, maybe some rags, maybe some gloves. And there's the T handle to pull the generator out. To open the hood, I mean. There's your side cameras there. It's a beautiful coach. I popped the hood. So you can see inside. It's a T-handle over here. Pull on the T. And the Jenny pulls out. All the maintenance is done through the side on the 10kW generator. So that's why we have to slide out the 10kWs. Where the 8kW generators, what's on the shorter Dutch tires, all the maintenance is done down below, so that generator does not slide out. That's your hydraulic leveling jack, motor, and slide out motor for the full wall slide. Easy, accessible. And of course, you've got your air horns over here with your windshield wiper solution. You've got an air chuck fitting. So you can blow up tires. Just got to get yourself an air hose with some fittings. So 
So it's been my pleasure to make this video for you guys. It's a fantastic coach. All four season, it's made to be lived in year round. That's how confident Numar is on their build. Has a one year unlimited mile warranty. So if you want to put a million miles on it, they'll warranty everything for the year. Of course we have, we also offer five year extended warranty availability as well. Okay you guys, well I look forward to seeing you soon. This is the coach. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.